I will have you disbarred. Disbarred? Okay. Right. And you don't ever walk up oh my, my God, stairs. I got no, don't, no. Do not walk up my stairs again. Get inside. Do not room. walk up my stairs again. No, I ain't coming up that building. You were not even supposed to come in here. I have a lot building. <音>有些人面对警察的时候，要么会喊“我爸是谁谁谁”，要么喊“我懂法律”。今天这位女士有点不一样，她认为自己比警察牛，她可以对着警察大喊大叫，因为她是一名 LPN。事情发生在美国的俄亥俄州，二零二二年十二月二十二日，这是临近圣诞节的好日子，大家都洋溢在节日的喜庆之中。但是这座公寓里有人报警。警察们被派往这里，开门的是一位女士。这位女士也是这里的房东。她不但没有跟警察说发生了什么，反而要把警察赶出去，不停的大声呵斥警察，非常的不礼貌。Yeah. Out of my building and get outside of my building now. No. Well, you're going to do it with two. Right now. No. Yes, sir. No. What's going on, Jeff? Yes, sir. No. I said yes, sir. No. It's not gonna work that way. What's going on today, man? Tell him. Get him down. Get him down. What's、well, this? I said, get him down. Okay. What's going on today? You're a lieutenant. No, I'm not a lieutenant. So get down. Because I'm not a lieutenant.、Anymore. I said, get down. And get out of my building now. I dare you to touch me. That'll be great. Oh,、well, that will never happen. I am an LPN. I don't get it. And I'm telling you. To get out of my building right now, this this already moved out. This doesn't work. They probably moved out because of you. Who called? You or John? I'm telling you to、She、get、called? out of my building. What? Why? 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 What's going on? Because I'm sick. I need to go to the hospital. What's wrong? You need to get. He's making me anxiety. What? Why is this happening? Why? 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 We're not even speaking anything. 所以警察也是一头雾水。本来是接警过来处理事情的，没想到遇到这位搞怪的女士。警察认为她可能是喝醉了，所以就没有过分的跟她计较，但还是要问她到底发生了什么，有没有危险的情况。女士又开始胡说八道，说自己得了癌症。警察说：“如果你真得了病，我们可以让医疗队过来。”女士说：“不用麻烦你们，我就是上西天也要待在这里。”接下来，他就一直驱赶警察，说自己是一名了不起的 LPN。LPN 的是什么呢？就是持证临床护士。可能在他自己的心里，他的身份比警察高多了。I will have you disbarred. Disbarred? Okay. Right, have me disbarred. Please do it. John, if you don't go away from me, I swear on my life, I'm going to kill him. Go away from me, you. Go away from me, and I know you're a lieutenant, but I'm telling you right now, I was a nurse for over many years. I don't care. Exactly. I don't care. I think it solved itself. <laughs> And you don't ever walk up、oh、my, my God, stairs. No, don't, no, do not walk up my stairs again. Get inside. Do not、room. walk up my stairs again. I'm gonna treat you like a four-year-old and start counting if you don't go in there. Do not walk up my stairs. Because if I arrest you now, I have a lot of building. You were not even supposed to come in here. I have a lot of building. I don't care. You. Raphael, you. 看这位女士疯疯癫癫的，警察就没有再跟她计较。
，这些警察的脾气真的是太好了。其实严格来讲，女士也已经违法了，因为她虚假报警。后来警察经过查询，就是她报的警，而不是她的丈夫。对了，女士的丈夫一直没有露面啊，哪怕女士在门外又吵又闹，里面的丈夫还是无比的淡定。不知道平时这对夫妻是怎么过日子的？在美国大部分的州，虚假报警都是违法的，需要承担相应的法律责任。女士明显就是虚假报警，甚至可以给她安上一个扰乱治安的罪名。但是警察并没有指控她，而是选择退让离开。这事本来就过去了，警察也选择了忍让，女士算是平安无事了。但是警察又回头要来问几句话，刚回来就发现女士在对着一位男邻居大喊大叫，还要动手打人家。警察说：“你骂我们，我们也就忍了；但是你打骂其他公民，那我们必须得办你。”所以警察当场就将他给逮捕了。自从被逮捕以后，女士的态度瞬间发生了变化，从嚣张变成了哭泣和道歉。但是已经来不及了，警察只要把你逮捕了，他们就不会轻易放了你，因为你已经违法了。看来面对女士这种人，警察也只能来硬的，该出手时就出手。被带回局子里以后，女士还是不服，说要见局长，但是警察没有答应她，怕她见了局长以后又要见市长，见完市长见县长，见完县长又要见州长。有很多人被逮捕的时候，其实说要见主管不算过分，但是想见大领导都是不切实际的。女士被指控扰乱治安，最后被判处一天的监禁。你没听错，就只判了一天。